Well, hello there, lovelies. I haven't really figured out the best way to do this video, in, like practically, so we're kind of just winging it, so hopefully it goes well. I'm here today to show you TikToks because, because I spend a lot of time on TikTok looking for like funny videos because my, like, I got the job somehow of finding funny videos for my boyfriend's videos. But then I also, I find so many like cute videos that I just love that I save for no real reason. And I've realized the reason is that I'm gonna make you guys watch them because I just, I like, I, I really have to hold back when I'm hanging out with, with friends, which you know is rare these days. But whenever I'm hanging out with friends, I always just wanna like scroll through my TikTok likes and be like, look at this bunny rabbit. And you know, it's not the best way to be social, but I thought maybe you guys would appreciate it. So here is a collection of TikToks that I think make life feel good again in these awful times. By the a portion of today's video is sponsored by Skillshare, but we can talk about that a little bit later on. So we're just, we're just, we're just we're gonna get started. Okay, so first up we have this little dog who's having the best day. So this woman is preparing a lovely breakfast. You might think, is this breakfast for her? But no, the dog, it has little pajamas. It has a little zippy up blanket. And look, just, it's getting breakfast in bed with little dippy eggs. And look, it's so happy to eat its dippy eggs and its raspberries and its little That noise though, that is like the one unpleasant part. That's like the one and only thing I miss, or don't miss, sorry, about having, because like, I had a dog as a kid. And literally the only thing in the world that I don't miss about having a dog was just the noise of them licking anything, whether it was like their food or licking themselves to clean themselves. Then that licking noise, like even as a child drove me mad. <laughs> it still does, but it's still so cute. <sighs> okay. Hi. Hello. Hi. Did you miss me? <laughs> it said a little. I'd be mildly upset that it only missed me a little, but delighted that it spoke. It said, it said a little, and that's so cute. I love what I love it when it sounds like animals are actually saying words. It is just like the most exciting thing. I don't know why, but it just brings me such joy. It makes the world seem like a colorful, wonderful place, and I just I love it. Little little animals speaking. Okay, so next we have this dog, and just... Uh, look at him! <laughs> what is he doing? He's still like, he's such a mess, but I would die for him, you know? I don't, I can't, that, that's all there is to it, really. Okay, if you need to feel like calm and happy today, I got you. I'm okay. Thank you. I will. I w Nor I will be happy. Nor that I have had this interaction with this adorable cat who wants me to be happy. I will be happy. That's why I love Nestle Crunch. <laughs> it's so relatable when <laughs> you've been sitting in the dark for a really long time and some asshole comes in and just switches on the light full blast and just ruins your life. I feel you little cat, it's little face. It's just so cute and funny. Oh my God, right, okay. Guys, this squirrel brings me so much joy. You need to experience that joy too. Look at this squirrel. Look at him go. Oh my God. Dude, I'm assuming, you are tripping out. I'm assuming this must be a new you addition like to the house. You specifically like your, for him, and wall? he is just living his best squirrely life. Junior, they are so fast and crazy. Look, <laughs> I love him. Okay, I'm gonna mute this one because it just has a song on the back of it, and there's not like much sound for the actual video, and so it's really not worth the copyright strike. But I just, I would die if this happened to me. Okay, like, are you ready? Like, as if this isn't, like, the seal's just jumping on the boat on its own isn't exciting enough. Like, that would already have me dead. Like, I'm sorry, can you imagine? Like, you're just out, it's a beautiful day, you're on a boat, life is already pretty great. Like, things can't get an awful lot better than that. And then, and then, the seal, sea lion? Sea lion. The sea lion just jumps on the boat. Like, like, things just already got, like, 300 times better. And then it rests its little head on your shoulder. This wild animal just got tired of swimming and it was like, hey, I'm gonna hop on this boat and just 
rest my noggin on this person's shoulder. I would have been sobbing. I would have actually just trying not to move or make sounds so I didn't scare it, but just cr just crying silent tears of pure joy. I'm almost crying thinking about it. Like my heart, I don't think my heart could take it. I think I would just die. I would die happily, but I'm pretty sure I would just die because I wouldn't know what else to do. Oh. Okay, next up, like, this one's, like, a little bit sad, but it's cute, and it has a fine ending, so it's okay, but it's this little dog in the snow. Spoiler alert, the little dog does not much enjoy the snow. Are you cold? Look, it's like, no, 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 oh. and it just sits down, it's like, oh ah! Oh it just doesn't God, want Bella. any part of it to Do be done. you feel better? Your seat warmer's on, you're it's wrapped in a blanket. <laughs> But she's still so upset by it. It's like, why did you take me out in the horrible cold? You knew I was gonna hit this and you did it anyway. Look at, me. Look at her shivering. Oh, I'm sure she's fine now. I feel bad for her, but it's just so cute and funny. We took Sebastian out in the snow once for all of like five minutes and he was so unhappy. He wanted no part of it. He was like shivering and angry. And I'm like, look, you're always trying to escape. This is what lies outside these doors, okay? Okay, so next up is this goat, okay? Do you ever look at and someone just... and wonder what is going on inside their head? <laughs> this idiot just enjoyed the heat lamp so much that he just stood under it until his butt set on fire. Okay, here we have another animal who was unhappy with the cold. It's this little cat oh, and just... <laughs> the immediate nope. Like, I think it gags at the cold. I think it literally retches at the cold and goes, no. Absolutely not. Not happening today. <laughs> I've never seen anything nope so hard at the cold. It was like, I can go inside. I'm a tough cat. I can brave the outdoors. And then the second that door opens, it's like, no, I'm a pampered princess and I'm not going anywhere. Okay, so next up is this bird. I always love birds. They're so funny. I wish we could get one, but Jake says no because they're too long. Right, just- No, It reached please. 20k. It's got a little 20k. It will not wear the oh. 20k hat. It will not. Look at its eyes. I love the way their eyes do the thing. <laughs> Just the dinosaur shriek of rage. <laughs> oh, I wish it would wear the little hat. That'd be so cute. Oh my god, next up we have a purr frog who's being tricked into taking its medicine. Much like you have to do with any animals and children, really. Maybe particularly fussy adults, I don't know. But it just, oh, the first time I saw this, it made me laugh. It's so excited and then just... <laughs> laughing and like the reason I'm laughing isn't because the animal's in distress it's just like how human animals can be if you get me like it's just it felt like such a people-y reaction to just be like <laughs> it just really made me laugh that it's just so like uh. and you know it's like it's not happy about it but presumably what is ever it whatever is in that syringe is helping the frog to feel better so I do feel bad for laughing but it's just so funny because it's just such a human reaction <laughs> okay we'll do one more and it's just this cat who looks so concerned and like, it's adorable, but it makes me a little bit sad. It's so just, hold on. Yo, why is he looking at me like that? What's up, little bud? You got a staring problem, pal? <laughs> What's wrong with him? Like what, dude? He's just looking at you, he's a baby. Why is he so concerned? Dumb little face. It's just, <laughs> someone better have done something to cheer this poor little cat up immediately after this video. I don't know what's wrong. I don't know why he's so upset. I don't know why he's so concerned. I don't know why he's looking around like something is so terribly wrong, but someone better have cheered him up. I have spoken. So on to today's sponsor. Today's video is very kindly sponsored by Skillshare, which is a sponsor we've had on this channel before. We love them. Skillshare is an online learning community and it has thousands of classes on all the creative things your little heart could ever possibly desire. So if there's a new skill that you've been wanting to learn, there's a good chance that you can learn it on Skillshare. They have classes on things like photography, digital illustration, different kinds of painting like watercolor or gouache. I also forgot gouache, gouache? <laughs> I'll show you how he said, but you know, things like painting and such, drawing, also things like entrepreneurship and building a website. There are just so many options. And if you're like me and you're just forever finding new hobbies to get stuck into, excellent website. I have a bunch of different classes saved that I really want to try out, such as this one and this one and a whole lot more because you know that I just, I have too many interests. And Skillshare is there to enable that. <laughs> Skillshare is specifically curated for learning so there are no distracting adverts or anything that are going to show up and annoy you. 
and if you get an annual subscription it works out at less than $10 per month. This year, much like last, is uh, an interesting time to live through, but I'm glad that despite all the chaos I can still learn new skills and get into new hobbies and stuff, and if that's something that interests you then you should give Skillshare a try. So of course I have a link for you guys. The first 1000 people to click the link down in the description will get a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership so you can start your new creative journey. Okay so yes, thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring this video, thank you so much to you guys for listening to me ramble about it in the way that only I can ramble. And we'll get back to what we were doing. Oh boy, okay, well I think that's probably it for this video, we'll see how it goes, I'm not sure like how timing will work out, it's, it's the first of an attempt of things, so let me know how you enjoyed it, let me know what it needs, does it need to be longer, does it need to be more, is it too long, just let me know how it went, what you thought, if this is something you'd like to see again, if not, it was, it was a one, fun one time thing, if you need more cute TikToks in your life and you need more of this, I can do that, that's something I can provide, I have an endless supply. So let me know! If you're new here and you enjoyed this, my name is Kaya and you you can feel free to subscribe and join the family because we'd love to have you. Yes we would! Of course if you do subscribe don't forget to hit the bell so you get the notifications so you don't miss the videos and all of that. You can also follow me on all manner of other social media. Did I, did, did I say like? If, if, if you enjoyed the video, like the video. I can't remember if I said that. And finally before you go, if you could check out my Patreon, that would be amazing. It is the best way to support this channel. And the link is down in the description. So yes, I do hope you enjoyed this. If, like, I mean, if nothing else, I enjoyed sitting here looking at cute animal TikToks and I hope you did too, so yes. I will see you in the next video. Bye lovelies!